Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Max from the Next Creation. If it's your first time coming across the channel, consider supporting and subscribing to the channel. By the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell because you will always be updated whenever I upload a new video. For the returning subscribers, thank you so much for the overwhelming support and from where we started from zero subscribers until where we are now. What are we talking about in today's video? We want to talk about the three months and six months contract. Yes, I know most of you. You will be completing your six months and six months contract as the World Cup or as the World Cup comes to an end. I think that's where the, where the contract will end. And I believe some of you you already have the return tickets with you, depending on which kind of company you came with. Already they have the return ticket because it was already booked in advance that from this date three months your return ticket will still have will have available with you. What does it mean for a person who wants to stay in Qatar or a person who wants still to look for another opportunity? Yes. We are looking for the opportunities. We have all the avenues, we have all the times. We talked about how you can definitely get it to get that opportunity for you to have your job or to have something for you at the end of it all. And today we want to look at what kind of startup jobs. I know most of us may come in this country, we have the papers with us, but it may be very hard for you for the start to get that professional job. Remember, some of this. Uh, some of these uh, uh, things in life we didn't take to move one step at a step at a step until we achieve one uh, at a time. It doesn't matter how you start, but it, it, what matters is how to finish. And perseverance is the best weapon for you to achieve whatever you have to do. I think most of you, uh, you definitely will uh, believe or you will bear with me or you will agree with me uh, when it comes to these Gulf countries. You have to persevere and, and make sure you achieve what you want at the end of it all. It doesn't matter what you do, so long as you get uh, what you call an uh, income or you, you get to earn at one of the, it helps you to upgrade in one one or the other and in today's video we want to look at those people that are on three months or six months contract what kind of jobs can you start with at a time leave alone what you had in your school what you went what you are training but what can you start with so long as uh, uh, for, uh, to help you get what we call a work visa which is which which can be approximately for two years because that will be a very good experience for you we look at the startup jobs that you can start with. You can look them out and starting looking up to these jobs. Don't wait to finish up your contract. Start now. I know most of you, you have what you call days off and I know most of you must have uh, what you must have what you can maybe for example, you must be having what you call four days in a week. What do you use for those days off? in that month. This is what I have to let you know. For the startup jobs you can do after your three months contract or six months contract is for example, we look at the hospitality. Most of you may underestimate what you call hospitality, but in hospitality department, there are a lot of jobs that you can do. For example, housekeeping, cleaning, and there are a lot of hotels in Doha, in central Doha, in the Pearl, in all other places. Move around with your CV, have a copy of your CV, move around to this. Begin moving to one hotel by hotel. Ask them, I need a job. Drop your CV. It doesn't matter how many times you get to drop your CV. And it doesn't matter how many times you get to move. But at the end of it all, when that opportunity comes your way, it will be one opportunity that is going to, to live in your life for a longer period and where you are going to learn for longer, you're going to earn for a longer period of time. So move with that CV. Move with an updated CV. Add those that experience that you are in right now, even if it is three months or six months. It's already an, a, a Gulf experience that adds your CV. Move, drop your CV. There are a lot of hotels. Ask them the opportunity. Drop. Ask if there is an opportunity. In case you find where people say we don't have what opportunities, request them politely. Can I leave? Can I leave? Can I drop my CV for any? any future opportunity that may come. That's the right way. You leave your CV. You never know what God has for you. Look at security jobs. You can go to most of these security companies. You can meet some of the security guards, try to inquire about their company, their openings in those companies. Move around with some of these security company offices. They are real. You can still Google on uh, using your phone, uh, find out the exact 
at office of the, most of these security companies, go drop your CV. You never know what may come your way. Even some of you might be in security right now and you came on three months or six months ago. Make sure you do your whole job diligently. Do it well. You never know what may happen. Your supervisor may recommend you. Not even that. Even that company may recruit you and take you off in on what we call a two years um, a visa then still something also you look at jobs like cleaning cleaning is also very good you can look at the cleaners you have a lot of cleaning companies we have a lot of uh, uh, cleaning companies here you can try to look up some of these jobs they can help you start up to stay in the country otherwise if you don't do the opportunity if you don't try to take uh, this opportunity right now you 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 you'll end up you'll be going you'll be going back to your to your country and that is what the, your contract and your visa say repatriating you back to your country so they they start for this they start for the search for these jobs will actually going to start right now and it has to start with you look at housekeeping we look at hotels we look at uh, the nannies we look at uh, these other cleaning um, um, uh, maid part time maids go to these offices ask them Ask them if there is an avail. Don't get scared. Be confident. Ask them if there's those opportunities that you can drop your CV at one moment. It doesn't matter how many times you drop or where you drop, but what you are aiming at is very, is very important. Yeah, it's something that very important, you know, you should prepare your CV. Have the fee CV with you. It's going to help you to move to drop and definitely you never know what may come your way. So I think that is the better I can give you. That's a small tip I can give you if you're in the country and you're thinking stay in the country after a three months or six month contract it's a better way for you to live thank you so much for coming back to this channel remember it's next from the next question giving you all the latest information you know about jobs travel and everything in between that you need to know about the gulf countries the world at large and something that we need to something that can help us evolve ourselves and live to greater horizon thank you so much see you again